SICA stands for the Society for the Encouragement of Contemporary Art, which is one of the museum's longest art interest groups and was founded by a group of art lovers who wanted this museum to really reflect new directions in contemporary art. And it's been focused on artists of this region and especially with the eye towards emerging artists. It's an award for artists um, often at an early stage of their careers and often marking really the first major presentation of their work at a museum. It's, it's very competitive in the sense that there's only a few artists per year who receive the award and it's really to showcase um, their work, to have a gallery devoted to your work as well as a publication. So I've been working with SICA for the last two years on the 2010 SICA Art Award as well as co-curating this exhibition and the book which really the exhibition stemmed from which looks at the full scope of awards that SICA sponsored. It's been important to really understand what are the different kind of shifts over time um, within the award program and how that is mirroring what else is going on in the Bay Area. There are artists from different generations sometimes approaching the same theme or subject matter in different ways. Artists who are looking at a history of landscape, but then also later artists who are kind of unsettling this history and looking at um, a history of conquest of nature. Artists speak of what it means to really have the work seen, that often you're in the studio and you don't always have a sense of who is really seeing the work. Um, for a few of those artists who are also Bay Area natives, it means seeing your own work at the institution that you've gone to for so many years, which has an international audience, which is getting the word out to a much larger, varied community. 